Black History Month brings back fond memories when I was a child and learning about black history, uh, black inventors, and it made me as a person feel a part of the American quilt. Mm -hmm. Well, black history means to me it's a period of time that um, we are reminded of when people actually were set free. They should have been, that should not have been in captivity at all. And it brings back a memory to remind us all that uh, it could happen to any, either one of us, regardless who we are, race, creed, color, or, or religion. Teach me black history, A. Hey. They be like niece. What? Can you teach me black history? You know why? It's one big mystery. All I need is for you to hear me out and for you, you, you to have no doubt. Got to look out, huh? Oh my gosh. When I'm born with this song, teach them what you heard. Matt, Miss, and Ellis Walker, just to name a few. Do you know about them and their breakthrough? See, Matt, he was the first to reach the North Pole. And Alice Walker, she wrote Polar Purple. Gary Morgan made the gas mask and traffic signal. Automatic air brakes invented by Grimble. Miss Angelou, poet for inaugural. Back in 93, yes, I'm on a rope. Blayson Hughes was a poet and a journalist. These are all important people who've been dismissed. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. It's really easy, it's, it's really easy. It's really easy, no need to get crazy. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. It's really easy, it's, it's really easy. It's really easy, no need to get crazy. Last name Owen. For those who didn't know him, he was the first to win for a medals, great athlete. Step up your game, he was the boss at every track meet. Everyone should know him, his first name was Jesse. Better than the first round was a secretary. Adam Clayton Powell was Mr. Silver Wright. And Ralph Bunch won a Nobel Peace Prize. Think I need a birthday light, teach me some more. I'm like, your girl is kind of tired and I think I'm about to go next time. We'll def take a look at all these names that we learned a little too fast and brought it to a course and got the home we mask. And teach me that history, teach me, teach me black history. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. It's really easy, it's, it's really easy. It's really easy, no need to get crazy. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. Teach me black history, teach me, teach me black history. It's really easy, it's, it's really easy. It's really easy, no need to get crazy. Hey, bro, you killed that. <sighs> All right, so right to me, that I have the right to be the man that was created to me. <laughs> hey, you gotta walk right now. So, Kelly, what does Black History Month mean to you? It means learning about black people and pointless tests for teachers about black people. <laughs> but you love it, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what does Black History Month mean to you? Um, means bringing up the things in our American history that were uh, races, well, obviously black, uh, contributed to our, to our history and made relevant inventions and political statements and advancements to make America what it is. Thank you. Thank you. Pride and honor. And more than one <laughs> So Justin, what does Black History Month mean to you? Um, well it's a, it's a pretty nice month. I hate that it's the shortest month of the year though, that kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, it's just a time to celebrate African American history and culture. You know, it's just, it's great because the Super Bowl ends and then all you have to do is talk about the NBA all month. It's my favorite uh, sport. I don't feel like a disenfranchised white guy because there's all the black people are like, yay, NBA. That's what Black History Month means to me. Thank you, Justin. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm ready. Come on, y'all. Go.